Nerds, Friendly Neighborhood Spoon here, and today we are unboxing the 20th anniversary colored hardcover box set of Scott Pilgrim. And of course, there is a box in a box. When I opened the Amazon box that this came in, for some reason, all of them were opened up like this. They weren't really sealed with tape and stuff, so I mean, sure, I'll, I'll, I'll allow it. I'm so excited for this box set because I have been waiting for a really long time for it. Brian Lee O'Malley and Oni Press, the publisher of the Scott Pilgrim series, dropped colored versions of the Scott Pilgrim books a long time ago. First of all, can I just say, I can't believe it's been 20 years with the Scott Pilgrim, what the heck? I guess I just kinda didn't realize also that Scott Pilgrim has been out for 20 years because I did not learn about him until I was in college from a best friend of mine, and that was around 2008, 2009, about four or five years after Scott Pilgrim had initially released. Regardless, that is a really long time of knowing and loving Scott Pilgrim, and holy shit, this box is actually so gorgeous. There's a magnet. Okay, maybe I don't put a slit there to begin with. Let's, let's do it over here. I'm super glad that I waited this long because this box set is absolutely fire and it comes with all six of the books in this super incredible packaging. And I believe this comes with some bonus stuff, so that's really cool too. Brian Lee O'Malley had actually mentioned how this box and sort of the branding of it was designed by the PlayStation 2 boxes and the PlayStation 2 branding, which I thought was really, really cool. The branding is so freaking sick. SP20 Scott Pilgrim, the 20th, with this two-tone packaging of orange and white with the blue logos. Oh no, wait, it's, it's all different on all of the sides. That's so sick. So we got Scott Pilgrim peeking out the front over here. SP20 Scott Pilgrim, 20th. And on the top, it's got the contents to let you know what's inside. Book number one, Scott Pilgrim's Precious Little Life. Book number two, Scott Pilgrim vs. the World. Three, four, five, six, Scott Pilgrim's Finest Hour. Number seven, Scott Pilgrim Collected Extras. And then there's a sticker sheet, some posters, there's a holographic print, there's an AC power cord? Excuse me, for what? On the side here, we got a sick shot of Ramona Flowers with the 20, with the PS2 style branding over here. Scott Pilgrim 20th Color Edition. And on the side over here, we've got the dope Scott Pilgrim. SP20 icon that they designed for this box. And on the back, again, contents. Every single character that Scott Pilgrim comes across, all the evil exes that he defeats and beats the hell out of just to get Ramona's. <sighs> Knives Chow, of course, on the corner, I believe. Oh, this is a gold sticker. Official seal of the International Board of Scott Pilgrim's Anniversary. And I also just noticed that the Oni Press logo that they have over here and on the top corner of every panel is in the Sony branded font. We've got the robot from the twins. I can't remember, the Karyanagi twins. I hope I'm saying that right if I remember properly. Scott Pilgrim just met the girl of his dreams, but there's a catch. If he wants a future with Ramona Flowers, he's got to defeat her seven evil exes. This 20th anniversary box set collects Brian Lee O'Malley's original six volume series, originally published between 2004 and 2010. Yeah, that sounds about right. I remember reading volume six. As soon as that dropped, I'm pretty sure I uh, pre-ordered that joint to get it on release day. Oh my God. Oh, this is beautiful. The books come with a SP20 branded badge on the spine. Oh, this is dope. Scott Pilgrim, the collected extras. This is so clean. Let's take one of the books out and just have a little peek. This book is definitely worth having in the black and white version as well. And of course in the hardcover deluxe colored versions. This looks incredible. Printed on a nice matte paper. Oh, the illustrations look so good. I think this is a sign for me to reread the series. I actually really adored the anime when it dropped on Netflix. I hope there's a season two. I don't know if there's been talks about a season two or if it's just done, but ooh, uh, this little envelope. SP20 Scott Pilgrim 20th with the SP20 badge on the back as well. Envelope contents, adhesive sheets, AKA sticker sheets, posters, holographic, 
print. Scott Pilgrim 20th quick start guide. That's so sick. I'm not going to read it all to you. There's even safety precautions. Although these books are designed to be safe for reading, incorrect usage may lead to serious harm. <laughs> to ensure safety, observe all warnings and precautions while using the product. I'm not going to read all of it, but here it is. I'll give you a nice little look at it so you can pause the video and uh, and read it yourself. This is freaking awesome. I'm so actually so excited for these stickers because I've been looking for some new stickers to chuck onto my water bottles and laptop and these are so fire. So these are pretty much artwork from the books as well as some SP20 logos. Don't be too precious with the stickers. They're meant to be used. Hell yeah. I love that. I definitely mean to use them. Let's see what this looks like. Oh, no way. Sex bob on poster and it's all just text. Sex Baba, May 22nd, El Macambo, 9 p.m., $5. It's literally just a uh, show poster promoting their first concert, first show. Scott Pilgrim's Precious Little Life, a book release party for Brian Lee O'Malley's new graphic novel. So it's like a flyer for when this first release, sponsored by The Beguiling. OG Toronto comic book shop. This is so dope. Like it's like having a piece of history. Oh, and this is the, the holographic print. Gideon Graves, Scott Pilgrim, and Ramona Flowers in the middle. Oh, it's printed so nicely. It's got a nice gloss to it. And that's it. That's all that's in the envelope. I freaking adore these goodies. These are so cool. Definitely got to figure out where to put the stickers. Brian Lee O'Malley, I promise if you're watching this somehow, I'm going to be using the stickers. Maybe not all of them, but I'm definitely using some. I love this so much. This makes me so happy. These covers are so rad. I can't remember if the covers are the same artwork or not, but they look so, so good. And the spines look so incredible. They use spot UV all up on the spines to give you that nice shine and, and shimmer. Back of the books also have artwork. Oh, they feel so good too. There's a nice weight to it. This was this was a heavier box than I expected. Oh, dope. The holographic print is the same artwork on volume six. Would have been cool if they had the same holographic treatment on this cover, but that might have uh, raised the cost a little bit. Kim Pines, Knives Chow on the back. Yo, this collected extras book is actually so thick. It's literally the same size as one of these books. That's so impressive. Dope yellow book, Scott Pilgrim collected extras, artwork throughout the back as well. What kind of extras are in here, Mr. Brian Lee O'Malley? Oh, cool. So it's like a, a little retrospective. Is that the right word? Brian Lee O'Malley gives like his his thoughts and ideas and his process. The original pitch of Scott Pilgrim. What's this? The original cover for volume one. Extra artwork. I think these are like bonus issues. Sketches for character design. And he goes through every volume. Are you kidding me? Oh, this is so rad. He literally goes through how Scott Pilgrim is made from just gesture sketches and figuring out what the pages look like all the way down to the lettering and, and publishing of the book. That's so cool. Yo, Brian Lee O'Malley, you popped off. Oni Press, you popped off. The rest of this video is just gonna be me like skimming through the books and, and, and fanboying out. This box set is so freaking rad. Thank you so much for watching me unbox it. If you enjoyed the video even just a little bit, please do the thing and hit the like and subscribe button. Thank you again so much for watching. I have been Spoon. I love you. Stay spicy and I'll see you real soon.